Good morning and welcome to the CBS 19 This Morning update. I'm Clint Hughes. And I'm Dana Huey. Some East Texas parents are furious this morning about changes made to a school play. Lindale ISD received a complaint Monday from the Wisconsin-based organization Freedom From Religion Foundation. The group says a Lindale parent alerted them about E.J. Moss Intermediate's musical program In God We Trust, saying it was too religious and violated the First Amendment. In response, school staff adjusted the program that ran Thursday night. Those changes didn't sit well with some. We were very disappointed to hear that they had to eliminate part of the program the girls or the children had all worked so hard on. In response to the program changes, Pastor Tom Buck with the First Baptist Church in Lindale rented out the Lindale High School Performing Arts Center so the students can put on the original version of the play. That performance will be May 29th at 7 p.m. The recent tornadoes in Oklahoma and North Texas are hitting close to home for East Texans. That has some looking for alternatives when it comes to home building. This is a small portion of it. They come in eight foot lengths. The people at Custom Concrete Homes in Malakoff are very busy right now. The company builds homes and safe rooms out of concrete that they say can withstand 250 mile an hour winds. But recently, they built the shell of an elementary school in Mansfield. You really want to have a place to go. You know, in many cases, these people, just like, you know, that have just recently encountered these storms, they didn't have a place to go. Now, depending on the type of safe room, prices range from a couple of thousand dollars up to $10,000. Looking ahead, now may be the time to prepare for hurricane season. Forecasters say it's going to be a busy Atlantic season. It's all thanks to warmer than average temperatures. The National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration Climate Prediction Center says we can expect between 7 to 11 hurricanes this year, three to six of those being major storms. A normal season would include six hurricanes and three major storms. Well, let's get over to Scott Fossey now with a look at your Memorial Day weekend. Clinton Dana, as we head into your holiday weekend, we're watching a cluster of showers and thunderstorms that formed late last night, early this morning, out near the Edwards Plateau area as well to the south and west of the Dallas-Fort Worth area. As that area of rain and scattered thunderstorms moves east-northeast, our clouds will actually increase during the morning hours. Some patchy areas of fog are already being reported around east Texas, and then an increased likelihood around lunchtime today, if not late morning, about a 40% chance for widely scattered showers and thunderstorms here in the East Texas area. As that energy moves off to the east, we'll see the rain chances going back down after lunchtime today and call for partly to variably cloudy skies this afternoon. Daytime highs in the mid 80s today with an east wind at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Over your Memorial weekend, isolated afternoon and evening thunderstorms both Saturday and Sunday with highs in the mid 80s. On Memorial Day on Monday, mostly sunny, a high of 87 degrees. Thanks, Scott. Check out CBS19.tv and TylerPaper.com for updates. Have a great weekend.